Dear students, this is Itisri and you are watching the channel Learning with Itisri. Okay, welcome you all to this session. Today, we will learn some other portion of the topic, the swimmer who does not need her legs. In the last session, what we have learned? A small recapitulation. Got session we have learned the lesson in the last session. So, what are they? The first one, C.N. Janaki, a young polio affected girl, dreamt to swim the English channel. And the next, she reported about her dream to English Channel Swimming Association. And the officials of Swimming Association, they kept two conditions. What are they? One, one should be able to spend at least 10 hours continuously in water. Jone oti komre dosa ghanta continuously pani re pohari paru thibo. The first condition. Second condition kon thila? One should be able to do marathon swimming. That is swim in the high seas for long hours. At a stretch. Jone marathon swimming kori paru thibo. Or thar. Bohu samay dhari kiri. Se continuously. Samudra re. Pohari paru thibo. So after that. What did Janaki do. To fulfill the conditions. Was she able to fulfill these conditions. To know about all these. Let's read the next portion of the topic. That is. Paragraph number 3 and 4 of the swimmer who does not need her legs. Janaki began training very hard in Bangalore to fulfill these conditions. After almost 4 years of training, she said I was able to spend 10 hours at a stretch in the swimming pool. An NIS coach Mr. Gopal gave me a certificate. Saying that he had seen me swim for 10 hours continuously. And paragraph number 4. Then, with the help of the Thimaya National Academy of Adventure, she went to the coastal town of Malpe and began training in the Arabian Sea. She spent three weeks there with a coach called Dinesh Subarna. She learned to spend long hours in the sea by swimming a minimum of 20 kilometers a day. Let's understand the text. What is there in paragraph 3 and 4? Okay. So, let's understand. First, what is the third paragraph about? Third paragraph re kon kuhaiji? It is about her training to fulfill the first condition. Her pele CN Janaki. Taro training visare kuhaiji. To fulfill the first condition. And what was the first condition? One should be able to spend 10 hours, at least 10 hours in water continuously. Isn't it? Okay. The next, what did Janaki do to fulfill that condition? First condition fulfill kuriya pe Janaki kon kola? She Begin training in Bangalore. Bangalore se training aramho kola in a swimming pool. Isn't it? Okay. Next. How many years she got training there? Kete varsha se jati training yonela? About 4 years. She got training there about 4 years. Chari varsha dharikiri se jati training nela. Then. What was she able to do after 4 years of training? After 4 years of training, what was she able to do? She kon kari parla. So, after 4 years of training, she was able to spend 10 hours at a stretch in the swimming pool. Chari varsha training nai sarila pore, she dosho ghanta dharikri swimming pool re at a stretch swimming kari pa pahin. 
सक्षम हो पारा व्हाट डू यू मीन बाय एक्टे स्ट्रेच एक्टे स्ट्रेच कहले कौन बुझ व्हाट डू यू मीन बाय एक्टे स्ट्रेच एक्टे स्ट्रेच मीन्स कंटिन्यूसली किसी गोटे काम कंटिन्यूसली 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 को आम एक्टे स्ट्रेच बोली कहता नेक्स्ट व्हाट इज एन आई एस इट इज देयर इन द ग्लसरी ओके व्हाट इज एन आई एस दैट इज नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स ओके नेक्स्ट ही हैड सीन मी स्विम देर इज ए फ्रेज देर इज ए सेंटेन्स ही हैड सीन मी स्विम हु हैड सीन एंड होम से किए कहा देखला किए देखला कहा देखला हु वाज ही ही हो जी एन आई एस कोच मिस्टर गोपाल हेड सीन जानकी कहा देखले हेड सीन जानकी कौन कर देखुले स्विम फर टेन आवर्स कंटिन्यूसली दस घंटा धरिक कंटिन्यूसली पहरबार से देखिले एंड ही अफर ए सार्टिफिकेट फर हाफ हि गेव ए सार्टिफिकेट दैट जानकी वाज एबल टू स्पेड टेन आवर्स कंटिन्यूसली इन ए स्विमिंग पुल ओके नेक्स्ट वाज दे ट्रेनिंग इन बांग्लोर सफिसीएंट फर हार बांग्लोर जो से ट्रेनिंग नेला वाज दैट सफिसीएंट फर हार नो इट वाज नॉट सफिसीएंट फर हार व्हाई व्हाई इट वाज नॉट सफिसीएंट बिकॉज आफ्टर दैट ट्रेनिंग सी वाज एबल टू फुलफिल ओनली द फर्स्ट कंडीशन देयर इज आल्सो सेकंड कंडीशन and she has to fulfill that also let's understand the text of paragraph number 4 okay what is the fourth para about what is it about it is about janaki's training to fulfill the second condition what was the second condition one should be able to do marathon swimming that means one should be able to swimming for swim for long hours In the high sea, at a stretch. Where did she begin training? Who did she training? I am not sure. She went to coastal town of Malpe and began training in the Arabian Sea. Coastal town of Malpe. Malpe who she went to the Arabian Sea? The Taro training she started. Isn't it? Okay. Next. Who was her coach there? सच्ची तरह coach किए थे ला? Dinesh Suvarna was her coach there. और सच्ची क्या coach थी ला? NIS coach थी ला क्या? Mr. Gopal. That is discussed in the third para, isn't it? And here in the Arabian Sea, her coach was Dinesh Suvarna. Next, what did she learn there? कौन सी खिला से कौन से training ने ला? She learned there to spend long hours in the ski sea by swimming a minimum of twenty kilometers a day. She learned to spend long hours in the sea by swimming a minimum of twenty kilometers a day. दिनों को अति कम रे कोड़िया किलोमीटर पानी भीतर ऐसे स्विमिंग करीबारो ट्रेनिंग से सेटी नेला आरोबियन सी रे. Next. Why did she choose Arabian Sea to take the training of swimming? Arabian Sea is a kind of training. Kind of training. Arabian Sea is a kind of choose. Because to fulfill the second condition of swim, uh, to swim the English channel. Now, here is a task for you. A flow chart for you. There are some key points and you have to write a paragraph following that points okay now a worksheet is here a flow chart is here first janaki then struck by polio then handicapped by legs then dreamt to swim the english channel then reported to english channel swimming association kept two conditions first condition to spend 10 hours in water second condition to do marathon swimming to fulfill first condition she began training in bangalore 
to fulfill second condition she began training in arabian sea and next became able to swim for 10 hours and arabian sea kore learn to spend long hours in water ei jo sabu point ra ko sabu key point ra ko key word ra ko sabu diya hai ji taku follow karikiri gobe paragraph lekhiba darkar that is a task for you kemite lekha jibo kete jano ki bisoy likhibo jano ki a young girl a polio affected young girl she wanted to swim the english channel who was struck struck by polio in her childhood in 1987 joda achi bhabe next as she was struck by polio she was handicapped by legs so as she dreamed to swim the english channel she dreamed to swim the english channel so she reported to english channel swimming association and they kept two conditions what are they first condition to spend 10 hours in water at least 10 hours in water continuously and the second condition to do marathon swimming then the ta pore tar sentence kon lekha jibo to fulfill the first condition she began training in bangalore and after training she was able to swim for 10 hours and for second condition she for to fulfill the second condition she began training in the arabian sea and after training she learned to spend long hours in water so the flow chart is here write a paragraph using the above flow chart okay so thank you for watching keep watching this channel